Hi guys, it's me, your best friend Joe. Welcome back to Monster High New Ghoul in School. This is part 18 of this Let's Play. Holy shit, every time I have to say a higher and higher number, it just blows my fucking mind. I thought this Let's Play would be like two parts. Look behind you, three of monkey. Oh, Jenna Fire, you still doing that shit to me? Have you found any secret passages? I have actually. What I want to do is I want to rob this fucking machine. Did you see that little flag over there? How have I never gotten this? Seven out of 20 of those things. Hit me. Okay, um, first things first. I'm the realist. I'm always gonna fucking say that after I say first things first. There are some really cute clothes in the store today, so I'm just gonna buy them out because I'm the richest witch in the school. And now we're going to, you know what? We're gonna go to class because I wanna talk to Manny. Can I go to, no, no, no. All the other cooking club happens before class. But all those other things happen after class, and that's what I really want to do, is I really want to focus on maybe Enviro Club, and I want to talk to Manny and Gil, because I literally do not remember what the fuck that storyline is. Alright, off to- I was gonna say off to class, but I can't fucking go to class, can I? God damn it! <laughs> and I swear to god, if this game fucking breaks again like it did last time, <laughs> I swear to god. Now we have to leave the hallway, then come back in to go back to fucking class. This bitch gone. Nice! Let's go to fucking class. How did she get stuck in the motherfucking doorway in the first place? <laughs> what kind of hair did she have? Was she the pig? Was she a pigtails girl? Maybe her pigtails were so fucking ugly and so fucking big they couldn't get through the fucking door. She might have not been pigtails girl at all. Who? I don't even fucking know. I didn't even fucking see it. We need a little help at the fashion club if you have time. <gasps> I always have time for fashion club. Oh my god! Look at all the things I have to do. No, no, I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go. Oh, I can't talk to Manny. Oh, that's a morning person. Or a nighttime person. Or a night nighttime thing. I'm going to fucking fashion club. I don't even give a shit what these witches say. I want to go see what the new drama is. Especially if Jennifer is having a fit again. Alright, fashion club it is. I don't really understand why they meet behind the, like, uh, stage. Although I guess they probably make the outfits for the actors in the play or whatever. Also, what sort of fucking play is going on here? I'm into it. I'm into tombstones. <laughs> That's my fetish. Ooh, no. Okay. Let's just fucking talk to somebody. There's a- Maybe my body's in there. That's not actually a prop. That's my fucking corpse in there. All right. What's going on? Ew. Do I have to talk to you? Can I talk to Jennifer? Finally, Laura Vanderbilt. What took you so long? I was like, that was literally 30 fucking seconds ago. Let's heat things up, girls. Today is going to be wild. What is going on back here? We still have a lot of details we need to scratch out. What's the next item on the list? Are we still doing that fashion show? How we'll see the audience? <gasps> Are they gonna do a fashion show on this stage? Uh, we want everyone to feel comfortable, like family at home. What about a table of scary sweet treats? Where are we going to come up with those? Not sure. It's the fucking cooking club. There you go, Skeleta. Fucking way to do the fucking obvious. Rumor has it the kitchen is a mess these days. Yeah, that is too bad. Yeah, Deuce is sort of like sloppy and his girlfriend's like totally possessed slightly. Deuce has to owe someone a favor. What can we do to convince him to join the team? Did I just fucking volunteer to do it? Could you ask Stu for cooking club self? Of course, you're the best, Laura Vanderpoop. I fucking know, I don't need to be told every day of my fucking life. Talk to Skelita. Did I not just? My favorite class is history. What about herstory? Girl, <laughs> there are things that happened in the past. The things which happened in the past shape the way things are now. Thanks, girl, for telling me the fucking obvious. I'm not gonna check my social media because it seems like that's what crashes the game lately. Um, I might check it at the end of this video, but, uh, I feel like my phone is so full of shit that it just, you know. Oh, God, don't check it, Joseph. I almost, it was my instinct to check it. Can't talk to Manny and Gil yet. Looks like we can only do the comic, we can only do the comic book club. That's the only nighttime activity we can do. I guess we'll go do that and we'll have to do some more shit tomorrow when we get to school. All right, fucking nerds, what's going on? Oh, this isn't the library. I was gonna, <laughs> I just run into that hallway. Okay, fucking nerds. All right, now where are my nerds? Hey, nerds! Uh, I hope someone else is writing this comic, first of all, because Gulia had some, like, grammatical, grammatical errors. So I bet you there's some sketches of Regina Ghoul, and I even had time to make a superhero outfit! Oh my god, that's amazing! Can we see the outfit? Not only have I constructed an outfit, but I also have concocted quite an elaborate plan of attack. If we are going to release our comic book, we need to get someone to wear this and spread the word! Me? I just modeled for the fashion club, but who's gonna dress up as Regina Ghoul? Will I be crazy busy writing the comic books? We need to get someone who isn't in a co comic book member. <gasps> I thought I was in the comic club. Oh wow, great. Thanks for uh, telling me that I'm not. <gasps> Holy shit. This is fucking banging. You look... 
you look just about ready to dole out some justice. How are we gonna spread the word, honey? I'm gonna go bitch slash some people out of this school, tell them Regina Ghoul is in town. Could go out there and do something heroic, but that implies some kind of problem. Perhaps you could talk to a few people and introduce yourself as Regina Ghoul. I will gladly. Can this shit go off my screen so I can look at my fucking outfit? <gasps> My headband doesn't match. Actually, it's okay. It's okay. It could be worse. It could be worse. It could be worse. What do I need to do? What do I need to do? Meet with students. I'm gonna go meet them and bitch slap them. <laughs> Maybe I'm more of a super villain. <laughs> I'm starting to think that I might be a bit of a super villain. Let's scare her. Bitch! Take off those wings. We all know they fake. Oh my god, what are you supposed to be? Make their own comic book hero? Oh, that's fantastic! You look great! I'll tell all my beasties. Kill me with the stones! Can this shit go off my screen? Spectra. Ah! Who's in there? I can't see who it is. How am I supposed to tell people about that? This is spectacular fun. Girl, it's fucking me. This dumb bitch. <laughs> well, you look like fun. Of course I like to read a comic book once it's finished. I thought I was supposed to do something heroic. <gasps> help! Help! Rochelle is, Rochelle is stuck in the graveyard. Can anyone help? <gasps> okay, I gotta go help Rochelle. <laughs> Rescue Rochelle in the graveyard. What did this bitch do? Was she robbing graves again? Homegirl was robbing some graves. Can I, like, roll up on you now? Now that I have a mask. Nope, she knows who I am. It's about now that I have a mask, can I roll up on her and fight her? Fight me! Oh, oh my god, there's a fucking thing. Have people, is this the one people have been yelling at me about? Someone's been yelling about one of them in the comments, and I'm like, I don't know what she's talking about. But I guess that's probably it. I've probably passed that one about 70 times in this fucking Let's Play. Wait, is there any new shopping to do? Oh, no, 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 no. Can I call people? Oh, no, this is where it tells me their flaws. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. What's going on? Oh, my God. They're all smiling. I would laugh at her, too. Don't be afraid. We're trying to work something out. <laughs> As they, like, laugh at her. Look at that dumb bitch. <laughs> We're gonna help you, Rochelle. Look at that dumb bitch. <laughs> we need some kind of hero. Maybe she's here to save the day. Wee! Butchoy! Sure, sure. What do you want me to do? I can't do that now. Of course you can't. Oh, because she's in Viro Club. That's why that's there. Look at me, like, literally learning. Oh, she can fly! I actually can. That's how I get around. I'm a fucking ghost. Our hero has come to save the day. Hello, is there someone out there? I am stuck inside the crypt. All I remember is looking at these dumb gargoyles out there. And this door opened up. The last color I remember seeing was green. I mean, that's green. All right, am I supposed to go touch that shit? Oh my god, it's a puzzle. Sorry, I'm getting a lot of text messages. <laughs> Just so popular. Okay, obviously we have to go to this green one. Oh, do I have to hit them all now that they're gr Or did that save her? Did that fucking rescue you? Oh. Oh, the last color she remembers seeing is green. So do I gotta pick green last? I just fucked that up. All right, let's do this one more time. Wait, I was thinking- The first color was yellow. Yellow, red, green. Th you think you could have fucking told me that before I had to walk across this entire fucking graveyard? I didn't even move my legs and I'm complaining about walking. I fucking float above the ground and I'm complaining about walking the story of my fucking life. Hey, ghoul! I love your cotton candy hair. Thank you. You look just like the hero. What is your name? Regina Ghoul. That's me. Merci beaucoup. Regina Ghoul, you said moi? Bye. Au revoir. Au revoir. I jump, jump, jump. A baguette? Okay. <laughs> well, real emergency. Right when we needed one. Not only did you... She's like, I'm so glad that bitch got stuck on the graveyard. Free promo. What's up? <laughs> Good job, Laura Vanderpoof. I know, sometimes I wish... Sometimes I wish bad things would happen to people. Not so I can save them, though. Just for kicks. Can I go home? What do you want? Did you see the news feed right now? That was a huge success! You saw my comic book club. I got something scary cool to show. Oh, that was the last thing she told me. Go home? Can I literally wear this outfit, like, all the fucking time? I'm gonna fucking wear this outfit every fucking day of my life at this fucking school. <laughs> Am I cursing more than usual? Yes. The answer is yes. Back in my dread room. Uh, we'll check that in just a second. So there's nothing new yet. Let's go to... Oh, she can't just... Yeah, shopping just updated. Shopping just updated. <gasps> Paper clips! How edgy. 
<laughs> How high school, actually. <gasps> Look at that green dress, tree green. That's probably what I'm gonna end up wearing. Let's go to sleep. Maybe we'll get an updated wardrobe for the morning too. Spirit spiders found, lockers opened. I didn't know we could fast through that, fast forward through that stuff, first of all. Change clothes. I wanted that green dress, where was it? Okay, my social media is just blowing up, but where is that new green dress I got? <gasps> Off the shoulder? That is so fucking cute. <gasps> green and per green and black? That looks cute. I don't know about this green and orange. Like, I know they, like, look good together in theory, but I don't know about it. We're gonna try it with- <gasps> Ooh! I didn't know I had green pumps. And I have those green paperclip earrings. Those are kind of tragic. We're gonna do those. Those, like, broom handles. I guess if I, oh, I have a green necklace, but I think that's too matchy-matchy. I think we should stick with the black one to match my um, leggings. That's cute. I kind of want to go platinum blonde today. I've been like waiting to go platinum blonde for the right moment. This one doesn't come in platinum blonde, but it does. <gasps> oh shit, that's cute. My headband matches my, oh, I gotta do it. <laughs> my headband matches my belt. That is so fucking cute. All right, we've already gone to sleep, right? I'm gonna tidy up just so you guys don't yell at me. Should we try blonde? I do wanna try blonde. Which one of these hairstyles is blonde? That one? No, it's definitely too much today. It's too much, too much. It's too much, it's too much. I can't do it, I can't do it, I can't do it. Yes, time for school. <laughs> I get so distracted during this let's play. It is fucking ridiculous. Um, oh my God, is everyone staring at me? This green doesn't, this green hair doesn't match super well. This is, this is probably like my second or third best outfit. Okay, it may not be my first best. I really wish I could talk to these hotties. I could never talk to them. And I didn't get to keep my superhero outfit. That kind of bums me out a little bit. I wonder if I get to, I want to wear it again. I want to rescue more people. But like, like put them in bad situations first. <laughs> Wouldn't that be like a really interesting superhero? Like a really bored one who... Like, there's no crime in the city, so they have to create crime, and then they themselves rescue it as well? Oh my god, did I just make a comic book? That's probably been a comic book, right? That's probably been a million fucking comic books. Of course, it stops working right when I click that. I don't know what it is about my notifications now. Well, you know what, though? That is going to be all for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you're still enjoying Monster High New Ghoul in School. If you are, feel free to give this video a thumbs up. When we come back, we'll be going to Student Council and Fear Leading. Uh, so stay tuned. Bye, guys.